Hi there. In this video, let us look at 7 ways to improve and boost the health of your liver. Your liver regularly detoxifies itself by removing toxins from your blood. Good habits like eating a balanced diet and getting regular exercise can support liver health. Your liver is the most hard-working organ in your body. It constantly filtering toxins from your bloodstream, balancing macro and micronutrients, and regulating hormones. Liver works hard without us realizing it. You only noticed something wrong with your body when the liver stops working properly. Liver conditions that go untreated can progress to liver failure, a life-threatening condition. Fortunately, there are a lot of things you can do to prevent liver disease. The most widely marketed liver health product is Liver Detoxify. It is everywhere nowadays. It is basically a combination of products purported to flush toxins from your body and help you lose weight. These cleanses are based on the idea that chemicals and toxins continuously build up in your system. But that's a misconception. The truth is, your liver doesn't allow potentially harmful substances to accumulate. Your liver swiftly converts any toxins that entered in your body it into something less harmful. Eventually, it's excreted. Adopting a healthy lifestyle is the best strategy to keep your liver safe and functioning well. Your everyday choices and lifestyle habits can affect the health of your liver in the long term. While these strategies may not seem as simple as a one-time cleanse, they're more likely to protect your liver and keep it healthy. Let us look at some key strategies that can help protect your liver in your daily life. Your liver processes every alcoholic beverage you consume, including wine, beer, and spirits. The more you drink, the harder your liver has to work. Over time, excessive drinking can take a toll, destroying liver cells. Alcohol-related liver disease includes several liver different conditions, such as, alcoholic fatty liver disease, acute alcoholic hepatitis, and alcoholic cirrhosis. To avoid alcohol-related liver disease, the best strategy is to avoid it at all cost. All medications, whether they're over-the-counter or prescribed by a doctor, eventually pass through your liver where they're broken down. Most medications are safe for your liver when taken as directed. However, taking too much of a drug, taking it too often, taking the wrong type, or taking multiple drugs at once, can harm your liver. Some common, over-the-counter medication can have serious consequences for your liver, when taken incorrectly, or with alcohol. Supplements such as vitamins, minerals, herbs, and natural remedies are processed by your liver eventually. Natural product does not mean it won't have long-term consequences for your liver. Some supplement that seemingly harmless are capable of doing serious damage. Well-known supplements that can be potentially harmful to the liver include performance-enhancing and weight loss supplements. Green tea extract is another common herbal supplement that may affect your liver. Even vitamins, in particular vitamin A and niacin, can cause liver damage if you take too much of them. Your diet plays a significant role in the overall health of your liver. Ensure your diet is benefiting your liver in the long term. Try to eat variety of foods such as whole grains, fruits, and vegetables, lean protein, healthy fats and good amount of clean water. If you can tolerate it, drink coffee. Coffee has been shown to lower the risk of liver diseases such as cirrhosis and liver cancer. Physical activity isn't just good for your musculoskeletal and cardiovascular systems. It's also good for your liver. Research concluded that both cardio and resistance exercises help to prevent fat buildup in the liver. Fat buildup is associated with non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. You don't need to run marathons to reap the benefits. 
you can start exercising today by just taking a brisk walk. Hepatitis is a disease that causes liver inflammation. Some types of hepatitis only cause acute, short-term symptoms like hepatitis A. While others are long-term illnesses like hepatitis B and C. To protect yourself against hepatitis, you can practice good hygiene. Take extra precautions when traveling. If you use intravenous drugs, don't share needles. Practice safer sex. Get vaccinated for hepatitis A and B. There's currently no vaccine for hepatitis C. Your liver process chemicals that enter your body through your mouth, as well as chemicals that enter through your nose and skin. Some everyday household products contain toxins that can damage your liver, especially if you come into contact with them regularly. Use organic cleaning products and techniques to clean your home and take precautions when using pesticides and herbicides in your yard. Although liver detoxes and cleanses have become popular, they are not proven to actually work. Liver cleanses are based on the idea that chemicals and toxins continuously build up in your system, but that's a misconception. Instead of opting for a liver detox, a safer option is to focus on healthy lifestyle choices and habits. Some tried and true liver-friendly habits include eating a balanced diet, exercising regularly, and protecting yourself from potentially harmful medications, liver diseases, and environmental toxins. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, please share, like, and subscribe our channel. Click the bell icon and let's meet again in our next video. See you soon.